In about 24 hours, Santa's reindeer will be off and flying. Other than that important role, not much is known about these animals. Well, that's about to change. In this week's Finding Minnesota, John Lortzen went to Lake Crystal near Mankato to visit one of the largest reindeer farms in the country. On a farm just a few miles out of town, guinea hens and Arabian horses are kept company by another animal. All of our reindeer are friends to Santa and Rudolph. All of our reindeer have names. You know Dasher and Dancer and Prancer and Bix. Oh, that's Bendy, that's Mistletoe. You'll find Sweetie and Lolly and about 30 other reindeer at Crystal Collection Reindeer Farm. He takes off, he tries to fly, one antler, all he does is buzz around in a circle. <laughs> 27 years ago, former teachers Bev Herda and Daryl Simon began educating people about these animals. They were looking for something to raise on Daryl's farm and got caught up in the Christmas spirit. As soon as I saw those reindeer, I said, you know, Christmas comes every year. Well, it's a lot of fun. I mean, you know, you, you get a kick out of kids and stuff like that. From early November through Christmas, you'll see them working overtime at holiday events across the Midwest. But when they're all together, it's all about the reindeer games, especially for the bulls looking to prove themselves. They will fight for, oh, it only lasts for two or three minutes. And we'll get a couple of antlers knocked off and, you know. That's how my kids are. Yep. Same thing. I yes. can raise reindeer. Yes. <laughs> Losing an antler is temporary. They grow back for males and females. When those antlers are growing, you can go out there and feed them at night, come back in the morning, and they've got two to four inches of growth on those antlers. So it's like you can almost see it growing. While they're known for landing on rooftops this time of year, this is a grassroots effort. Raising a winter animal is a year-round job. Springtime can be especially busy. It is so exciting. Um, my best time of the year is when we're having baby calves. Those baby uh, reindeer are, are cuter than a bug's ear. And see those little ones get up and start wobbling around and stuff. It's, it's just exciting. From the clicking of their hooves to the rattling of their antlers, there's no guarantee any of the reindeer at this farm will ever guide someone's sleigh. But they don't need to, to help make the season merry and bright. It's been awesome. That's never going to go away, and it's just, it's just gotten bigger and bigger and bigger. In Lake Crystal, John Lordson, WCCO 4 News. The reindeer at Crystal Collection Farm are fed twice a day and get a diet that includes sugar beet pulp, alfalfa hay, protein, and copper. For more information on the farm and their deer, we have put a link on our website. Just go over to WCCO.com and click on links.